Oh, you ready, ready? No, no, no. I, uh, was, I wanted to welcome, talk about this. Welcome, was, uh, welcome to the uh, welcome to the show, y'all. As you see, can see, we have so much more room for activities now that that's the uh, <laughs> what's the Joy Step Brothers? Step Brothers Joy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got room for activities. <laughs> I'm missing some folks, but you know, we here though. Yeah, that's what matters. We here. We're here. Hey, B. Judd Apatow, speaking of Step Brothers, did y'all realize? Have y'all like looked at his filmography? Uh. Uh-uh. And it's Wait, entirely what's now. the boy name? Judd, Judd Apatow. Oh, this guy. He he directed. He be directing and producing and a writing. lot of those mo- and writing a lot of the funniest mm-hmm. movies that have come out in the last ten to fifteen Love, years. Love, Undeclared, Girls, Ben Stiller Show. Funny or Die Presence? Those are shows. Oh, okay. I'm talking about the movie. So, like, was he involved in, like, Talladega Nights? Yes. And Keep what going. you just said? Step Brothers. Okay, yes. Forgetting Sarah oh, Marshall. Marshall. Yes. Um, it's a bunch of them joints. I can't think. Oh, that was I just I happened had. to see it the other day, the and I was like, Sarah damn, this Marshall. man right here is Oh, the- he did uh, Knocked Up. And then, of course, this is 40. This is super bad. Super bad. There you go. A couple of them other Get him to too. the Greek. Yes. yes. Wow. He got a what, whole... Wait, was he a director? He's, he's a writer. Oh, he's he does it all. all. He directs, hey, he man, writes, that man, I'm funny as hell, bro. He does it all. It's, it's just crazy how many classics he got under his belt. Bridesmaids. I don't know if y'all saw that. That was actually what? pretty good. He did Bridesmaids too? Anchorman. Oh, stop. Pineapple this Express. Bama, this is with the goat, dog. The Dewey Cox story, Walk Hard. All of these joints. 40 year old virgin? Yes. Yeah, that was him. That's him. Wow. Yeah, he's fun crazy. with Dick and Jane. Dog, is he is he a gajillionaire? The cable guy. I mean, get him out of here, dog. Liar liar. Look at all this. It's ridiculous. Did he find an avenue that America just loves and we just the five year engagement. I like that movie for some reason. That's what it's gotta be. Yeah. Okay. Hey man, the Jonah Hill be job looking like the penguin, dog. He's he starting to look like the penguin. penguin. Yeah. yeah. Even uh, even with his weight loss, he still yes. would be he looks more like the penguin now. now. Oh mm-hmm. Jonah uh, Hill. Are you are they gonna do that? They should. They should. Are they, they gonna do it should. where they do the um the Riddler and all of it in one? No, that wasn't that Batman. With the pink one, there was Catwoman was in that one. Yeah, I think they are doing Catwoman. Oh, I can't believe you remember that. <laughs> Catwoman. Um, and um, and Nicole Kidman was the uh, was it Nicole Kidman as the Catwoman? Was she Catwoman? No, that was Michelle Pfeiffer. I can't. They, yes, they, it was. One of them. Michelle. Pfeiffer. Nicole Kidman. I feel like she was in the mix though. She was in the Batman mix. Was she the girl? Who was the girl he was interested in? Cool. Let's go. Oh, that's uh, what's her and name? And I think Batman Returns. I think that's Batman. Forever? Who was the girl? Who was that? I don't know if it was Nicole. I can't Kidman. believe you know about this. this was, what? Oh, that's why, our time. Why, why, oh, why, why wouldn't I know? Maybe it's just because you was a girl and I didn't think you was watching stuff. Oh, I like loved that. a good Batman. Those were good to um, me. I know they went dark later, but I like those Batmans. With Poison Ivy. Poison Ivy was in there. And that the Riddler. Yeah. That was another one. That's with uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger and... Batman and Robin. Oh, that's he what was that Mr. was. Mr. Freeze. Mr. Freeze. Yeah. yeah I knew, I knew Arnold episode. had fell off when he did that movie. Oh. I was yeah. like, dang. What, what do you mean, fall off? He was on? on? I mean, he uh, had that, his... that was right after, like, Terminator. Oh, shit. And I grew up watching Kindergarten Cop. That oh, was, yeah, Kindergarten yeah, Cop. Kindergarten was Cop was. I'm was... saying, like, he was, like, he was... The like he was it. Yes, Arnold was the uh, oh my God. last action American hero. Oh I don't even go front to you. Uh, looking back, I'm like, a lot of this stuff was that like, he's a horrible actor. Yes, but a lot of the movies were tailored for him for because him. he was that guy. Yeah, he had just finished doing um, True Lies too, which was a great. That was a great action. I'm more, Terminator. I Terminator think that was more two. of the storyline. 
I like true a lot lives. of a lot of true lives is a good storyline. It was. Tom Arnold actually helped with that too. The comedic relief in that yeah. movie. He didn't do bad. Because I don't really like Tom Arnold. Actually, that movie was funnier than you would think it was. Yeah. It had a lot of funny yeah. And Jamie Lee Curtis, she did a she good did job, good. too. She did, she especially from she being is. from, like, a, uh, I guess, a frumpy housewife. And then she had to turn her sexy on. Yeah. Her strip dance was funny when she <laughs> fell. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, Arnold didn't do bad in that joint, though. Mm-hmm. Nah. I actually I don't do think he's a terrible actor. I, I, I didn't agree with you when you said that. I just stayed quiet, but... He's uh, not terrible. No, he doesn't have several different lanes. Actually, he does have multiple lanes. He does. What's the two lanes? The Garden Cop is he completely still with different. Himself. The New Terminator. Nah, he oh, was saying, like uh, the machine. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Give me two right there, though. It's that's it. Then. Can the Garden Cop and then <laughs> Terminator. Okay, all right, but he hold on. Was else. he a husband? And he was a husband in in uh, True Lies. He was like the yeah, the that family was, that man. Was, that was, was staying, a cop. That was staying Terminator. Kindergarten Cop. I feel like yeah, true lies yeah, kindergarten. Yeah, I'm, 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 and, and, and I'm not saying that he should have right. all kinds of range. I'm just saying, looking back, I'm like, man, he wasn't really. The reason he was able to do what he did, or part of the reason, the main reason, was because he was Mr. Right. Mr. You Mr. know, Olympia. Yeah. Was, right? That yeah. really segued him to his path to success. I think he turned out. But good. I'm tripping off the fact that you didn't realize. I didn't say. Arnold was that dude. He was all right, you know. Who was, did you, who did you. I'm trying to think. I was trying to think. Like, who I, who did I. Because it was you a girl. It was Jean-Claude Van Damme. And Jean-Claude. I like him. Oh, that's I why. I did like he, Jean-Claude. He thought he was more. The blood He was sport. more appealing. The double, double, what was yeah. it? No, Lionheart. Blood sport. And Blood sports was his. Double trouble or something. Double Remember, something. He double played take or something. something. Cause he played like himself. He had like a twin brother. I was just spell Jean. I ain't gonna friend. I was a Jean Claude fan too. Do you, oh, it's spelled like Jean. Jean. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's Jean. I knew that. Jean. Yeah. I did <laughs> like that movie. That was my dude, dog. Blood <laughs> sport grown by Jean. Book, dog. <laughs> that joint was that was the joint, bro. Jean. Uh, I knew his career was over when they did the Street Fighter joint. I was like, yeah, that's it. Damn, yeah, I guess that was the when fall he, of When him. he played Guile. Yeah. Lieutenant Guile, an American, and had rocked around with that Russian accent. Oh, you know what? I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> oh, speaking of which, I saw Disney's version of the, um, well, second rendition of the Mowgli. The Jungle Book. Oh, Have yeah. Have y'all seen that? No, the, yeah. is that the um the one live that's action? Real. Yeah. Okay. Uh-huh. Yeah, I saw that. Who? Who? I like Jungle Book. Yeah, me, me, and my daughter watched that. I'm thinking about something else. I no, did you like know Jungle the Jungle Book. Book. Yeah, I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about what movie was the dude from True Blood, Eric? What was he in True recently? Blood. One of them remakes like that. He was Mulan. Yeah. Was nah, it Mulan? wasn't. What's the other? It's joint? only like it's Aladdin. Mulan. It was a live action. Or this is and Lion else. King, that was it. No, was it wasn't a live. It was, but it wasn't. It, they made it into more of a real movie. Uh, was it The Jungle Book? It, it's Mulan. Who is it? Who got raised by gorillas? Yes, yeah. Mowgli. Yeah. He, they did that with wolves, him too. Wolves. No, wolves. this guy who got raised by gorillas. Oh, I don't know. In the in the child book. Nope. Nobody. Go ahead. I figured. Oh, okay. But go ahead, y'all watch no, the Jungle anyway, Book. Anyway, yes, y'all know that. And movie. it was really good. It was good. I could not get past the fact that this was supposed to be a movie that was taking place in the jungle in India or in that region of the world. Okay. Why was wrong with it? Bruh, everybody had a British accent. It was pissing <laughs> me <laughs> off. All the animals. I'm like, why do all the animals have British accents? And accent. the little boy have did it the have Amazon. Any, did it have anything? The- well, yeah, they probably who they cast. <laughs> I they mean, usually make them give up oh, their accents. It to. was almost to the point where my daughter had a hard time enjoying it, and I realized it, and oh. I was like, "All right, I got to, I got to chill." Because mm, you were so mad. Oh, you were you calling was, it out. You I was, was like, "This is Tarzan." Oh, uh, Tarzan. That's yeah, no, you were right. You were right. Bad. I can just not remember Tarzan. Because I <laughs> see, I feel that way about Tarzan, and I always have. I like um, what was the Jungle to Jungle? I don't know what that. That was uh, 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 John Claude Van Damme. No, what? that was with um, who got arrested? Tim Allen. Jungle to jungle. 
You know what? I never was like up on his stuff like Tim that. Tim Allen? Mm-hmm. Yeah, if it wasn't Home Improvement, I didn't Watched care. Watched Home Improvement sparingly, and that yeah. was about it. You said you made me said Tarzan, that made me think of Jungle to Jungle. I don't even know what that is. It's a movie. In, he in has 1997. A, he was married to a woman who decided to go off grid, basically, and live with like people oh. in the, uh, India or something like that. Yeah, okay. And, and she raised their son there. So he got to an age, like 12 or 13, where she felt like he needed his father. So she she brought him, like he was raised in like... That's crazy. Africa, if you will, or something. Yeah, and then 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 brought him back. And he was trying to live. He didn't, he don't know nothing else. Right, and he didn't know nothing else. So he like, he like... That took seems, all the fish out the fish like tank and, ro- and roasted them outside on like a, a spigot. Uh, you know, he used to living uh, off the earth. Okay. He was trying to, you know, transition into like, it was a funny little kid movie. Okay. I liked it. That seemed like it would have been funny. Yeah. Tim Allen, I think he had some nice little joints. I just didn't watch him. Yeah. Like the joint with uh, Kirstie Alley, where they was they infiltrated the little Amish oh, joint. Oh, of horror. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I see people, you know, watching that joint here and there, and I never watch it. Oh, yeah, it wasn't bad. Oh, okay. It wasn't bad. What we got this week, y'all? Mm. You got me talking about what well, is in this joint. We got the Olympic stuff. Oh. Uh, <laughs> right? Right? I was there with you, like, God. Oh. Mm. I was so excited about her energy. I was, like, showing her to, she like... Richardson? Yes. Mm. I was so excited about her energy and... So what's so what's your stance you know. on it? What is, what is who are you upset at? Who are you most upset at? Hmm. That's that's the question I have because you know on screen mm-hmm. I am mad at the Olympics mm-hmm. for you know testing for something that's legal almost everywhere. Okay, and she wasn't breaking the law where she was doing it at either. Okay. So I am mad at them on screen. All right. Now, if I could turn the camera off real quick. Mm-hmm. What the fuck was she doing? I you know, know you got to. You, you, you know you got to run, right? You're a special joint, dog. You right? Yeah, you uh, a you standard, knew a you had to run, is right? Required of you, correct? You know what I'm saying? Like and you know, with the bravado that you showed. If they gonna be looking at they anybody, they, they gonna be they looking, gonna at, be looking at you yeah. through a microscopic mm-hmm. lens. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So. Mm-hmm. Well, I, I'm I'm very <clears throat> proud of the responsible response that I'm getting from a lot of you because you know now people are turning this into a, a racial oh, thing. Yeah. What about this person who tested for this and was like, yeah. like bro? Now I, I I do feel like you got to keep that same energy. You know what I mean? You can't ban one person for something and then not ban somebody else. I mean, you know, but that's a different. That ain't got nothing to do with what she did. I think. And, and, why? and you know why what I'm saying? Like I hold, I hold, I can't now. help but hold. My people and to a different standard. And everybody keeps saying stuff like, I, I man, no the four years, she going to be the front runner. I'm like, shit, that's four years. That's yeah, a, long time. That's a lot of training years. between here I and mean, now. That's a lot. Now and in the, in the, when she smoked that J, you know, only, she, she did only, that. She only Who knows? Right. Who knows what she's going to be going yeah, yeah, on yeah, the next yeah. four years? <laughs> Shoot. Yeah, I, who knows? Yeah. She might be in one it of them wheelchairs sad. in two years coming from Atlanta. It was... Oh, no. <laughs> coming from... Uh, uh, coming from... The Dominican Republic. The, 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 the DR. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. From Atlanta. Right. Who knows? She might choose a different <laughs> career. You know? Yeah, I don't know. She... You know, it's very disappointing. I was extremely excited to see her perform and cheer for her yeah. and root for her. And to see it go down like this is... It yeah. sucks so bad. I'm kind of glad that they was like, nah, we're going to go ahead and opt out, even for the little four Boy, by one. Who, she decided to do that? No. Oh, I'm the, about to say, uh, I thought they the did. U.S. team was like, eh, I'm glad because I didn't want to see her. I, if I want to see, I want to see her do what she came right. to do. Right. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. want to see her. Why you know. do you know why they decided against that? They was just like, they probably was like, man, this is pointless. Really? Yeah, we're going to fly you out for this one thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Not, not. You gotta think. That's a team effort. I know. Gold medal is a gold medal. Though. It's like it's like uh, it's like heating up the oven to make one chocolate chip cookie. Yes. Or you doing the stove top popcorn though, and you put one kernel in there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Fine. You're, you're, if all you wanted was one cookie, cookie. I, it may but be a good you cookie. know. Yeah. You're not going. Nah. No. Okay. Yeah, you save a trip. Save. You know. Yeah, you gold medal is a gold medal, though. 
Yeah, but nah. You'd rather get it. That's nah. I like I said, I'm glad that they was like, nah, we're gonna go another way. Well, they still have Simone Biles, of course. Yeah, she a beast. Yeah, she's she, obviously and, the best. Um, but I wanted I wanted more. And there was there was the swim girl, don't know her name. Oh Le, oh. Not, oh, I'm thinking of the oh. the white one, Ledecky. Yeah, no, 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 no. no, no, no. It's but like, the black one. Yeah. Who won, yeah, who won the, uh, the I ain't gold feeling medal. what they did with them swim caps, though. So They're who not was allowed. the deal with the swim caps? Because so I heard something about that, too. So there's a certain type of cap that's better for certain types of hair. Curly. And they banned them yeah. at the Olympics. Yeah. That, Why? Because it was new? I don't know. I don't know if it's they new. They said it's excessive. As everything else we What's do What's the joints called? Soul cap. Soul cap. That's the name of the company. That and the joint is so perfect. It's so perfect. It's such a whoever came up with that. It's the such a great cap. idea because it's for people whose hair isn't stringy. Stringy, yes. You know what I'm saying? Who is who is not easily manipulated the way? Sure, stringy people hair people. Yes. So they should all just cut their hair off. What swimmers? The, the girls just in, in solidarity for the, for each other, you know. What I'm nah, saying? you know that's a different ball game. What the women, hell? Bro. Hair, what is women. That? Okay. Oh, talking about even the stringy people. Nah, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. If it's solidarity, everybody. Everybody got to do it. Actually, so we all cut it all off. They should. Now I'm, I'm game with that. If we all doing it, I'm with it. I'm, I like that too. Or maybe the people that didn't get their stuff banned should cut theirs off and mm. and support maybe in so. protest of what. <laughs> you want to, you know, show support, bro? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Mm. Who else in the Olympics that's, you know, making headlines? For us? Yeah. yeah. It's kind of quiet, no? Uh, Usain Bolt is out. Well, that's yeah. the only thing I... I'll be seeing that bad man in a little Gatorade commercial. Boy, that boy, he look out of shape. Oh, yeah. Why you see, when I mean, get, I see mean, what I'm saying? Bro, he is. He, four years ago, he was popping. Right. Look at that four years. Yeah, and he's a man. But at the same time, and he reached right. and, he reached the mountaintop. He did, he did. Reach multiple times. So he like so he, man, he I can, can be. Yeah, he like man, I've been training all my life. <laughs> I'ma let it all go. Whatever. Bama, I mean he let it go. That Bama is Hey, hey. I'm mad at that, but I'm not mad at that. No, yeah. you can't be mad at that. Yeah. Especially when I'm pretty sure his lifestyle and his probably diet and regimen, everything else has been rigid probably for a years. A long time. He's yeah, like, man, yeah that's true. So to like, take a break from go. that, I'm yeah. pretty sure was nice. He probably be over there, Dre, like, pull me one. <laughs> <laughs> pull me two. I'm at <laughs> <laughs> Leave it out. <laughs> pull me two. He's like, oh, you're going to go? Oh! He's like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> You hear his uh, Jamaican accent? Oh, I did it. Yeah. That's what you was trying to do? Is that what that, that was? Wasn't what, that I wasn't what I was trying to do. I didn't think that was that. No, yeah, I, I didn't, I didn't get that I was that. me as a Jamaican, but I wasn't Jamaican. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> so there was, a, um, there was a conversation between a, I guess, I'm guessing it's boyfriend and girlfriend, right? Mm -hmm. In which the girl gets a job finally, you know, she's making like, Seventy thousand dollars a year. Oh, good job! And she, I guess she's just finished school, so she sends her boyfriend a text like, you know, hey babe, it's so amazing. I got, you know, I'm making this money, you know, and he's like, oh, I'm so glad that you have this now. I'm about to quit my job so you can support us for, you know, at least the next four months. He said because I'm depressed at my job and I need to find myself. I need to go to therapy, you know. This type of thing, and she was like, "What? Quit your job?" And okay. she and he was like, "Yeah, I, you know, I gave you four years. You were a full time student. I supported you the whole time." She was like, "How could you be depressed? You make a hundred thousand dollars a year." He okay. was like, "Well, I don't like what I do. I need to find myself. I just need this. You, so you're telling me you're not going to give me this time? Just a month?" She was like, you can't do both. You can't go to this therapy. <laughs> you can't do both. You can't go to this therapy Damn. and and um, still keep your job. Mm -hmm. He was like, no, I just want to do this. Right? Okay. And so she was like, no, nah, I can't be with you no more then. I'm out. Oh, she so left? Right? Oh, right. This is all, what, I'm, what I'm telling you, though, is all through text. Right? Okay. They're talk she was like, I can't do this. I'm out. So then he was like. Okay, great, great. I'm glad I know. I know you're not wifey right, material. Right. I wanted Facts. I wanted to know this before I proposed. Yeah. And then she tried to hit him with like, "Oh, babe, I knew you was playing." 
I knew it. He was nah. like, no, you weren't. Come get your shit. Let her go. And you're gone. Hey, that's, first of all, that's a ter- <laughs> first of all, you played, that's a flawless you played execution. too much. <laughs> oh, you played too much, first of all, dog. That's number one. It was good to me just to see the plot twist at the end. But, you know, um, but damn. Do you have to test people like that before you go down that road? Yeah, but you don't have to manufacture those tests. There should be, there, there should be so many different things that... First of all, if he would have just had the conversation with her. That's what I was going to say. Like, uh, why didn't he initially have the conversation? Like, once you do get something substantial, I need to fall back from mine because this ain't working for me. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So that it's on her radar, even though it wasn't real. Right. That's not something you spring on somebody. So, is he, so he's wrong then. Is that no, what you're saying? I'm not she saying broke up with him wrong, over text too. But yeah, she's breaking was, up with him over text. She this was can't like, be real. I can't do this. This can't be real. You don't think so? No, the text, not over text. The text. Were they have a long distance relationship? No, I think. Let's just hypothetically well, how, if, say it's how real. old. All right. Well, f- well, one thing: how That's old true. they are. That's all the people do That's is true. text. That's true. Let's be clear. Like, because I could be having a conversation with you, and once the conversation starts getting to a certain amount of meatiness, <laughs> I'm picking up the phone. Right, but that's our they, generation. They like yes. Right. <sighs> Not even FaceTime. I don't like. I feel like the, the, no, these they use. overuse that. That is overused. What FaceTime? I'm, I'm in the bathroom, dog. Like, what, what's up? <laughs> I mean, I can't smell it. I can't see. No, but face. why do like I, you don't I have to see my it. face? I just, Keep that same energy. You the one that freaks out about that, not me. I don't like it, dog. I, I don't. You want to freak like out? It. I'm okay with the whole bathroom thing. He's like, oh, use the bathroom. I'll call you back. <laughs> <laughs> As if he has like, not what, seen me give no, birth to like, times. Like, what but, are we doing? Like, why do we? I mean, there has to be some place like where I'm you can just you have the your poop own. It's not like I'm showing you the or something or the pee. We're yeah, just no, talking, no, and I happen to use the bathroom. It's not an emergency. I don't want to experience that. <laughs> no, I don't want to do that. I don't want to go. It doesn't there. bother me, you know. <laughs> I don't want to go there. Okay, but back to the guy. Is he wrong? Like for handling? You said it's not a. You could do tests like that. I think that's kind of, in a way. It's a little bit childish. Like it's almost like you're fishing. Game. It's like it's yeah. almost like you're trying to make make something go wrong. He got or, what he or, wanted. Or, or he looking want, for he a wanted reason. To break up with her. He got or what he wanted. Looking for a reason too. He yeah. got what he wanted. He he probably saw some indicators before and was like, you know what? I'm gonna do this test. Right. I'm gonna do this and see if I'm and right. And see if yeah, that's if probably. this is real. You know what I'm saying? My question is, why couldn't he? He could have accomplished the same thing by just having a conversation with he him. Needed, she wouldn't, he wouldn't get a reason that way. He needed a mean? reason. He needed, the, um, he needed the validity of a situation to make her react. Yes. The hypothetical wouldn't have got the same reaction, I'm guessing, nope. as this seeming Something so real. real. Mm-hmm. Like her, you can front with a hypothetical. You can like, say what so you would look, do so and look, this, make it sound this good. Is, this is what I'm thinking I'm going to do. Uh-huh. Right? And she like, you could be like, oh, I'm going to put my best foot forward while you're listening. But when I'm not watching is when it's when it's important. I guess. You know okay. what I'm saying? Okay. I, I guess. I I would have that's how I would have handled it. But <laughs> first of all, if I had that kind of doubt anyway, I'm not Don't do it. Yeah, that's that's a whole other thing even, too. I'm not even, you know what I'm saying? Not that type of doubt. Like I want the backstory now, cause I like I said, it has to be something no, that made him think. More. Oh, they, yeah. she ain't, yeah. she ain't the one, but I don't have a good reason. Like, doubt where I was like, yo, are you yeah. gonna hold me down or not? Yes, man? yes. No, something had happened. Maybe, maybe it was a, a accumulation of things. Who knows? I can imagine that maybe she was as selfish because at some point, granted, if we're living together and it's nice, were that, they living together? Yeah, that's what he was like. Come get your shit. Maybe um, his homies been telling him like, man, she ain't got no job. You out here doing something you don't even love, and she knows she don't care about you, bro. Yeah, she was getting through school. You know, she had spent the last. You four, paying her way through school? school he you. wasn't paying her way. Though. I don't know if he was paying her way. He didn't you, say you took that. It too far, he was yeah. supporting he her. He was supporting her through while school. while she was. She had a you place to a live. Little, yeah, that's a a huge expense. <laughs> <She could've, laughs> I mean, okay, I guess. That's a huge. I expense. guarantee you, if they weren't living together, he <laughs> she, she would have been in school. Somewhere. She would have found somewhere. Else. I mean, she still would have been in school. You probably right if she really wanted to go. You know, but sure. they lived together, so that means he was pretty much. Supporting How old is both this of them. Do we know that? No, we don't know that either. Because that's important. Mid twenties. I'm yeah, thinking that's what they that's, are. I was thinking mid thirties. I was thinking no. mid to late. No, I don't think so. I don't so. think thirties. Nah, Not with her they wouldn't be texting school. this. You know, people go to school whenever you know. Yeah, I know. She could have been going back to school. Touche. That's true too. 
You know what I'm saying? So now she would have had a job though. Yeah, most people in their mid thirties they going to school and they working. Most people that at go back part, to school at already least got something. Time. Now if they got a nigga that's you know. making six figures where they living with and is holding them down. I wonder where they live. Yeah, that too. There's so many questions. Because, <laughs> right. Because I'm thinking about a hundred grand, I'm like, where they live? Man. Right. Yeah, but that te- I don't I don't like testing people like that though. Yeah. I I don't like that, but I like I like to. I like for you to show me what you got going on, but I don't want you. I don't want to be like. But you, you're forced to show me. You now. know why? I want it to happen naturally. But also, it well, puts I, you in a light as well as the game. Yeah. Well, you know what? I think it's more of like what you guys were saying, where it was like he knew, and this was just like, no, this is the proof that I knew. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Because she could try to justify other things away, or maybe I didn't. I, you know, I was just playing or something. Yeah, but still, this is actual text proof. Yeah, that trist- proof. triflingism is is That's a new word. Let's define that triflingism. Triflingism. The the act of being <laughs> trifling. Yeah, the act. Oh, it's a, bu- a, a constant act. It's a bunch of them walking around. We ain't got. <laughs> it's, it's, yeah. it's probably one out of every two. Speaking yeah, of trifling, oh, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's not cool. But <laughs> let's talk about this bonnet thing. Oh, we're going back to that. Okay, all right. Okay. Oh, we already talked about the bonnet. Yeah, you talking about you talking about with uh, Auntie um, mm-hmm. Monique. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man, we, we, we discussed that. It's funny because ever since we had that conversation, I'd be seeing joints out on the street. I'd be like. What are your thoughts on it? Okay. All right. That's fair. I, that feel, is fair. I feel like <laughs> she is being attacked for no reason. The yeah, I, just, I think it's the source. Like, I, I think they ha- people mm. have genuine. Yeah. Uh, a little bit dislike for her. Why? And just, because of her shenanigans more recent. The whole boycott Netflix. Just her. So Why she boycott seen, Netflix to support that was, Dave? That was like two, three years ago. Remember? Was she trying to support Dave or just? No. This was about herself. She said Netflix was racist and sexist because they didn't offer her the proper money. And, oh. You know what I'm saying? Like she's had a lot of little antics that seem kind of crazy or a mm-hmm. little bit off and a little bit more like... Um, they're not coming from her. It's more coming from her man uh, slash manager. She being she be influenced. Yeah, it, it. She doesn't seem to speak for herself, and when it does, it seems a little manipulative. Mm-hmm. But I think her opinion is warranted. Like it's her opinion, and that's how she feels about um, you leaving the house and being respecting yourself I agree by looking with her. a certain way. I don't see nothing wrong with that. I agree with her. <laughs> I mean, right. there's, there's so so. I mean, you got you know these black women who are always calling for certain levels of respect, and why do black women get put in this box? Why we got to be treated this way? Why we got to be treated that way? Mm. I mean, there's a lot of things that come with that. You know, what I'm saying appearance matters. Uh, the value that you put in yourself should be reflected in one way or another on a consistent basis. What you're doing a one-off when you run into the store, whatever, that's fine. Yeah. But most of these women, they're putting, they're making a habit. They're walking out the house with them same slippers. Uh, you, you know, know they it walk- just so happens that a lot of, you know, I see stuff on the internet, and a lot of the times I see like fights at like a Wendy's drive-through, be one of them. or they have a bonnet on. I, I don't know if that's you know if that's direct correlation. Maybe the bonnet makes you angry in public. The I'm not sure. You so stupid. Angry in I'm public. not sure. I'm just saying. I see a lot of fights happen on Instagram, and a lot of those women have it's, have um, it's a cultural bonnets thing. on. I think if you out here with a bonnet like that habitually, you don't care. You don't care. And, Monique, and most people that don't care end up doing that type of stuff fighting the fist of fighting. cuffs and all of that they don't care they ain't got nothing to lose they don't care that may be the case. even if they do have something to lose they don't care yeah. huh so maybe there's one or two little girls who just you know is from that area and that's what everybody else do and she don't know no better and maybe Monique helped them make maybe 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 Monique so. helped because like I was saying I think it's it's Monique's look Monique looks at herself in a certain light that these girls don't look at her in. well and here's another to add to that at one point in time a couple years ago I think it was what's um Lil Wayne's baby mama which one the first one he was actually married to her oh she married to she ended up marrying the dude what's her name no. 
Am I supposed to know who it is now? But no. With this? But I, I'll pop, 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 she going. Go is it pop, it. lock, and drop it? No, that ain't it. It's uh, the other joint. Oh. It's the other joint. It's not shoddy, though. What's uh, the other joint? What's the girl? Help me out. Toya Wright is her name. Thank you. That is her name. Toya Wright. What's the other dude's name? What's his name? What's his song? I don't know who you talking about. He had about. a big song. Hustle. No. Hustle. Not Ace Hood? He had a big song. Everybody did a dance to it. Mm. Soldier Boy? Carry on. So... A couple, it's been more than a couple, it's probably been like five years ago. She tried to make bonnets fashionable. She had like, I swear, she put like rhinestones and stuff like this on it to make it like, I guess, more designer esque. Okay. And to make it more fashionable. Still, I didn't think she made them to wear out I'll, publicly. Right, right, right. But she saying, just wanted to add a little flair, a so little something to it. when you're laying it. with it on, it don't look crazy. I'm guessing your man see you with the bonnet right. on. Right. Oh, more, still more of an in-house thing. Let me thing. tell y'all something. Yeah. The bonnet is the equivalent for the hood, to the hood as the, it, it, the do-rag is for the man. Agreed. Okay. You're not gonna see a certain type of dude Agreed. rocking a do a do rag. And okay. The dude that's rocking the do rag out in public today. Yeah. He don't. He don't he care. Wanted, he wanted them. No. He don't care. He wanted okay, them. Go so the other way. There was a dude that I know personally <laughs> who had beef that his woman wore a bonnet to bed every night. <laughs> okay. Oh. Made me feel away as a black woman because we have to keep our hair. But he, he was. I think he, he was, was saying like, man, I don't want to see that all the time. What's the what's the what's the oh, tell them to offer a solution? I see, understand. I see. Solution is get with somebody that don't, don't have come. to do that. That was his solution. Oh, that was his solution. Yeah. Is that what he did? <laughs> he did for a little bit. <laughs> oh, he was one of them. Yeah, uh, one of them. Uh, Wait a minute now. Uh, okay. It's um, the truth. Um, I don't like this, and it and it matters so much more to me that I'm gonna go try this somewhere else. Yeah. And then come back. I mean, it's not like they stayed there, but the point was they made the comment. I mean, life is a, is a journey. It's all about learning. Here you go. Go ahead, lawyer man. <laughs> I'm, just, just playing. I'm just saying. It was I'm not saying was. he was right or and wrong. And they hated black women at the time. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no, no. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But nah, I, I get your beef with that. That was a beef with But me. I think a lot of times, we talked about this recently, I think a lot of times people just, they, they're inconsiderate inconsiderate of others. The they're things just that they don't about, know? Yeah, they're just worried about themselves. If you know it's what not I'm your struggle, oh, yeah. come on now. You, you know, they don't that. they don't get the perspective. They 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 looking at it from their perspective, you gotta and that's it. That. You got to preach that. You but that's, that, that's usually the problem with most uh, relationships nowadays. Most people are looking at it from the standpoint of, me. I want to get with somebody who can do X, Y, and Z for me. Yeah. Not let me prepare myself so that when I find the right person, I'm in a position to be X, Y, and Z for that person. And even even as you find that, once you find that person, as y'all go along and grow together, part of that growth is Still. understanding, mm -hmm. hey, it's not just my perspective. Mm -hmm. I got to look at this from their perspective mm -hmm. as well as mine and see how we can, you know, move forward amicably. Yeah, we don't we don't groom we don't groom husbands and wives no more. Yeah. Not, not in the sense where we're grooming relationships to last forever. I don't think we groom, as a society, we don't groom hmm. husbands and wives no more. Say more. Yeah, yeah. Say more. I, yeah. Mean, these, I mean, it's funny how all the housewife shows are divorced women. And that's popping. And that's popping. Mm. Hmm. I had to stop watching shows like that. They were making me, they were kind of, you know how people say what you watch, you kind of internalize. And yeah. Like it to so, makes you toxic or I think some of them was making me angry. Bro, like it, So you. then I became a little bit more angry than I should have been over nothing because that, that shit didn't apply to me. So, yeah. you know, and so I had to stop watching. So I haven't watched those in It'd a It'd be the same thing with music. Time. Like I would be listening to, I'm like, oh man, I don't really be, you know, I'm grown. I don't really... But some some of the people I be listening to, like dog, what he's saying is really cool. Like, I kind of want to do this, or I kind of want. If I'm ever in a situation uh, like this, this is the kind of bravado I want to have. I got you. Yeah, but truthfully, dog, I, I don't need to be do, like I don't need to be doing that. It's still influential. The thought process would have never crossed my mind to stick my head out of my car with a blunt and a big booty bitch in the back. Uh, you know. With a Rottweiler on the side, whatever, like you know what I'm saying, whatever the ridiculous shit they be saying, like 
Who but, said that? Who nah, said I'm going to look that song up? Like, who said it? I want to know who this is. What beat? Is it a nice beat? Oh, no. What's this? You see the. Um, What's that for? <laughs> you see the video, though. You got to put the video up. The video of the dude trying to ghost ride, ghost walk with the. Oh, with the oh man. That's nice. horrible. I had yeah. no business. Send it to her, bro. Uh, I'll see if I can find it. The, it that was bad for business. Oh, right, 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 right. The joint with though, you have to send it to her though. No one goes riding the whip is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But so if, so it's not he wasn't was, He was doing it to a car or a bike. Yeah. He did it because he seen other people doing it on music videos and rap videos and it did not end well for him. Oh. Uh, yeah. He didn't know they have like stunt devils Nah, like, I don't know. Though they at least got people doing something. They got some organized level of Dog, it, it, it can't be that far back in your archives, my G. Mm. That's interesting. It something else, my bad. <laughs> um, so I remember what I wanted to talk about, though. So we were talking about... Uh, is the girl's name Shakari Richardson? Shakari. Shakari. All right. I don't want to disrespect the girl. Shakari Richardson. So um, previously before that, uh, there's, been, there's a lot been going on with black women or women in general this week, this last couple of weeks. So I don't know if everybody knows who um, Rachel Nichols is. You know who Rachel Nichols is? I, I'm not a sports. That's okay. Watcher. Do you know who Rachel yeah, Nichols I know is? Who's Rachel, okay. Rachel Nichols is a is an ESPN I, analyst. I, I, the question was for you, not right. for me. Oh, she is okay. an ESPN ESPN analyst that works very closely, almost exclusively with the NBA. Um, she has a very good relationship, very long standing relationship. I mean, she has been. Rachel Nichols has been in ESPN and working with the NBA for years. Um, she don't even look the same. Like she's, you can even see how she's aged. Anyway, that's not the point. Point is, um, ESPN has been doing a better job at hiring minorities and putting them in front of the screen, making them an, an issue. So, so apparently, Rachel Nichols made a comment about one of the newer ESPN analyst, I think her name is Maria Taylor, who is a black woman. Okay. Somebody got her on recording. Like a Zoom call or something, right? I think I heard something about Something this. like that, suggesting that she, well, saying that, she, basically suggesting that Maria Taylor only got, because right now it's NBA Finals. Mm -hmm. Biggest time in the NBA. Right. So to cover um, that is. To cover that is correct. Okay. Right. And like I said, she's been in the game for a long time. Mm -hmm. So, and she is exclusively NBA. So she probably felt some type of way about it when they gave her or had her match or share the coverage with Maria Taylor. And she made a comment that insinuated, hey. It's because. It's because she's black. Did she say black? She, did she say because nah, she's she black? she didn't say that, but she did. It insinuated. It, she didn't say that. But it insinuated. She she said right be, because be, because it is uh, socially like they're trying to do the, the cut it thing, right. Now. The company is trying to do the right thing, and uh, they, and they know Black Lives Matter, right? And they know that they have this agenda that they want to continue. Yeah, um, and she fits she fits the profile for that agenda. So not because she's better or she does good, it's just because of her the agenda. So basically. so without so without you knowing either one of them, how does that make you feel? As a as a black woman, well, yourself. it's typical. I'm not surprised by okay. it. It's typical. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's so funny that white women do stuff like that when they benefit. You know, they get more privileged than we do all the damn time, but cry the most. Yeah, anytime it's funny something that they're considered a minority too. Yeah. I don't even. Is she black? Well, no, she's not black. Rachel Nichols is the whitest of them all, so the I don't even know why I asked that. She's um, a ginger. But I'm saying, like, they're considered a minority. <laughs> like, the, if if there is a bill that a woman passed, is a minority, a white woman is considered a minority. Correct, correct, correct. Um, so that's what I'm saying. Like, they benefit. But from that's how she's those viewing minority. It. But that's how she's viewing it, though. That's how she's viewing it. She's viewing. And first of all, from the white woman's lens, is that what you're saying? She's. What did we just talk about? Everybody only focuses on the struggle that they have. Their oh, struggle right, right, is right, their right. realist. She's right? like, man, you taking my opportunity. Right. I've been doing this for this long. And she's not saying, oh shit. I don't she like deserves that, it. She's saying, man, she get my opportunity on some affirmative action BS. Right. When, when she got her um, opportunity off of affirmative action maybe. BS. Maybe. Hello. No, not maybe. Hello. It's not maybe. It's 
Hey, but Definitely. did you peep what happened though? You know yeah. how that came out? Who who snitched? So what happened was there was a Zoom meeting. Okay. And everybody was in it, right? All the mm -hmm. you know ESPN mm -hmm. staff or whatever. The meeting ended. People stayed on. People stayed on. She stayed on, and another young lady, well, I don't know if this lady's young, another lady stayed on, the mm -hmm. lady that she was talking to. And you know, they, they record these calls. And they didn't know that it was recorded. Who? Because at the, the time, the, the recording talking. stopped. It just so happens that another girl was on still, and once they got to talking, she was like, I'm going to record on my own. Oh, okay. Yes. And recorded the conversation Women after so the fact shisty, though. because she <laughs> knew she there were probably indicators of her talking greasy before and was like, oh, my, I'm, about to, was I'm there. about to get her now. Mm -hmm. I'm about to get her. But check this though. So she records the conversation mm -hmm. and she like, thank you. Sends it to corporate, right? Guess who gets to go home on suspension? Oh, Rachel Nichols? The girl who, no. The girl who recorded it? The girl it? who recorded it. Really? Nothing has happened to Rachel Nichols. Really? Yes. So, so what's... What, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's supposed to happen to... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> what's supposed to happen to Rachel? That's not true. But she... Rachel, well, now. Nothing happened right, right. until the public found out about it. Right. But, you know, that's from a year ago. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. The joint happened. It sounds like six months. Know, yeah, in the pandemic. Time. Yeah, during the. During so the, the wait a minute. The girl who who recorded the thing. She got suspended off rip because she recorded a private conversation. I don't know why they have some clauses. I don't know what they're just that. That's illegal. There's what? laws that say you can't record people without their knowledge. Is it? Yes. <laughs> then, then how are all these people not getting sued? Probably because they don't have a lawyer. Ooh. Like there's so many people that you know things happen to them in public and whatnot, and they get. That's they different. Get, that's different. Now that's not. That's not that. We're that talking. That's considered a private. Yeah, we're talking about like yeah, situation. private conversation, like oh, so okay. something like a phone call or something yeah. like that. Okay. But yeah, she you, still should be reprimanded or should have been. Rachel now. Nichols. Yes. So what did she? What what happened to her now? So I don't now, expect it from now, ESPN. Now, now she's been suspended. With pay. I don't know with pay, oh. but she's just been, <laughs> she's been suspended just, from coverage of the NBA. Mm -hmm. Damn. And the NBA is about two it's about two weeks left in the NBA. So, so now Maria Taylor working harder now, huh? Yeah, she she, getting all the shine. But nah, but then well. ESPN is gonna go back and replace her with a black woman. Oh. Uh Maria Taylor? No. Rachel, oh, Rachel Nichols. Nichols. You think so? so? There's gonna be two they black did. Women. Oh they did. Yes. So it's gonna be two black women. While she's suspended. The point is she was right. <laughs> That's the point. <laughs> No, oh, no, shit. no. She was not right. <laughs> no, no. no. Go, go they can't it. get rid of the white woman for saying something bad about the black people and replace her with another white woman. Why That's not? That's just stupid. Exactly. That just <laughs> no. lets you know that, that she's <laughs> no. on to it. No? Obviously, they are in tune with, no. with what the social... But why does that have to be the factor? Why can't it be like, this girl actually got some damn... She didn't skills. make the rules. She just called it. No, I'm saying like why. Well, her, we don't. Well, we don't even feet. know how good Maria Taylor is. Like, I guess we all see. All we see is them in front of the camera. R Rachel Nichols is way more popular than Maria Taylor. Right. Is that by design? It's just by tenure, probably. Oh. Yeah, the popularity. Yeah, sure. So, to the public or to the ESPN, they're gonna put forth who the people want to see. Right. The people want to see Rachel Nichols. Hmm. So it's obvious that there has to be something. I don't know. People might want to see Maria Taylor now. Sure do. I guess. With that racist, racial I don't think it's I racist. What you're saying. I don't think I, it's racist. I, 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 she I'm just, just like you said, she's just looking at it. She could be. She may, but I don't think there's enough here to say she is. But I'm not saying she, like you said, she's looking at it from her perspective. Right. She more than likely like, man, this is some bull. I don't like the same thing that probably got me my job. Right. And I didn't even think about that too, because that's that's, that's what it is. That's true. If some at one point, and I'm not saying it's women struggle right or to wrong, get in the industry. But yes, yeah. they weren't. That's then. true. And she been the prime one. Move over. Let somebody else get a shot. That's true. <laughs> Time to move on. That's hey, true. hot off the press though. Did y'all know about Donnell Jones' new Supergroup? Yeah, I did. Oh, I ain't know. They ain't hot off the press then. No, 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 no. I just heard about it like an hour ago. How y'all feel about that? It's so who's in Donnell the Donnell Jones, 
Uh, what's my man's name? Yeah. Carl Thomas and Dave, and Dave Hollister. Oh, they bring the 2000s back. The shy. Because I guess they all oh. from Chicago. Dave Hollister is not now, for sure. I don't know about the other two. I didn't know they were from this Chicago. This joint might not be that bad. It ain't going to be LSG, but... It'll be, it'll be good. LSG. Man, this joint LSG might... LSG came Dave out, Hollister though. He might be able to get uh, TGT. T- that, oh, no, yeah. no one even knows who that is. They no don't one even know. TGT. No one. They knows don't know who TGT. TGT. Oh. They don't know about TGT that. TGT is the lesser of the Groups. rendition group comeback. For sure. Yeah. Okay. For sure. But what I'm saying is, I think they could eclipse what TGT did. No, oh. don't take nothing. Yeah, they don't. I mean, you, me, and Doja can do that. Oh, don't do that. Get out of here, bro. Get them niggas out of here, bro. <laughs> TGT. And I like Tyrese. You do. They had a couple I little do. joints. I like Tyrese, dog. I need- I think he's talented. Let I me like say that. I like the whole album. I honestly. think he's talented. It wasn't album, a bad album. It wasn't a bad but album. But it wasn't an LSG type joint. Well, you know, I'm. I think they're going to make a bad album. Tank is corny. He uh, is. Tank is a corn ball. He can't he help is. it. He's talented. I know. He, he talented. can't help then it. And that's why I'm talking about it. I didn't realize, it. like, how much of a. No, he is a dick. Like, ball. he's almost a dingus for girls. Nigga. Or he's... goof. Uh, he yeah, you can tell like he never girls. got. Guys are like he's that. like he ain't never yeah. getting but. girls. Right, <laughs> right, right. That's how he is. Right, right. That's how he is. Yeah, he's pretty. Bad. It's a lot of guys like that Bo- though. I think. Boobies. <laughs> Boobies. <laughs> it's a lot of guys like that. Though. That's how. He think is. about it. Think about what women think that men like now. Yeah, he and he's that. That's what I'm saying. It's a lot of guys out here that's doing that, and the women like, oh, I gotta get. Stuff for I, them. Yeah. He's a cornball. They appealing to a bunch of tanks. Yes, they are. Lord have mercy. And it's sad. I it's thought so I had sad. something hot off the wire. No, um, no, 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 you, no, no. That's no, not, I mean, no. It just happened. That literally yeah, just happened, though. I didn't even know everybody in the group. I just saw a picture of Carl Thomas. I was like, oh, what's this? Oh, and I didn't read. Oh, okay. You yeah. know, but. I, I like Carl, Dave Hollister, too. I so, love Dave Hollister. I met Carl Thomas once. He's mean. Hmm. Everybody says that about celebrities. And they'd be like, Bams is mean, no? Well, I don't say that because I was a kid at the time. Oh. Like, I wasn't even like... So, a, it like, wasn't like, like I was a, a, No, now I was like, let's get out of here. I ain't trying to go to jail. Did he do that? No, he didn't say that. Uh, I'm uh, saying, was it that type of energy? Did he insinuate no, that? Like, it was like he didn't even want to... Oh. He, he didn't even want to speak. Like, we were a group... Uh, we were a group of... Um, so, uh, where I grew up, we had a black student union. Mm-hmm. <laughs> don't Please don't do that. Why is that funny? <laughs> that we was this in college? No, no. Well, so we grew up. You know it wasn't in college. No, it was it was high school. Yeah. Oh, okay. We had a black student union. Where I grew up. And um That's the part we, he laughing at. We were able to It's so funny that they had a black student union. And we were able to we, we made like a drill team and stuff like that. You know, dancing. Oh, okay, stuff, all right, drink. all right, that happens. And um <laughs> it, it was dance too. <laughs> They wanted to bring they y'all wanted to bring and, y'all culture into the mix. And so, um, <laughs> what happened was, you know, on the on the college campus because the where I grew up is a college town. They would have acts come, like mm-hmm. you know, Soul for Real and for real? Carl Thomas. You I know, had they all were, the concerts out there, all the concerts she'd be telling me that she went to. I'd be like, what? And I, how? So we why? were able. Why they going there? Say, why we, they were, there? we were able to open up. But why? For Carl oh, Thomas. the drill team opened oh, up for yes, them. like the local high school opening up. Oh, for that's Carl cool. Thomas, that's right? cool. I wonder how much he was getting paid and to so, do them gigs. Yeah, I don't know. This was at the, the the show was actually at the university. So the so the oh, kids, okay. so the university students Sponsored. had to buy tickets mm-hmm. to the show or whatever. And y'all got to go too. And we got to go, of course, Everybody. because we opened up. A college team. Yes. So we opened up for him. We did it. So of course, you know, after it's over, we get to go backstage and meet him. And mm-hmm. he was like sitting in this chair with this girl. Like she was sitting on. Let's just say it was like an arm, and she was sitting on the mm-hmm. arm. Okay. And and I guess maybe his assistant was kind of like, hey, Miss, you know, Carl Thomas, or whatever. Here's so and so. We were, the the we were called T. We were called uh, T I G. Okay, all right, T-I-G. Tell it, girl. Tell it, girl. That was the name of my group. But That's actually not that bad. Hey, hey. Excuse me. Hey, hey. Excuse me. G. How you making G? Hey. <laughs> T. T. I. G. So that was I don't thing. like, I don't, I don't hate that name, though. I don't hate that name. That's not bad. I thought you were going to come with something else. Yeah. So. Because you said T-N-T. No. Ow. No. <laughs> <laughs> We TNT dynamite. We, we the bomb. <laughs> <laughs> this is awful. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm waiting to hear. Well, go ahead. Tig. Oh, right. So me Tig. Like me Tig, and he was just like, 
he stared at us and didn't say anything. And we, were all, and we were all like, hi. And he never said anything. Like, just stared at us. And that's I saw, I was like, oh, he's rude as shit. Weird. Maybe he was fighting a case or had some stuff. And he was like, nope. nope. I ain't saying nothing, nothing to no minors. Yeah. Didn't say a word, didn't, Tiffany. So he just stared at us. That so we just, what, we just left, you know. But we were all like, you, you know, know what, though? He got that look in his eyes. There's something's going on here with this guy. Is that, uh, that you said that was Carl or Donnell? That's Carl. Carl. Donnell Thomas. wouldn't do that. Donnell wouldn't. Do that. That's what I'm saying. I'm not surprised with him for some reason. I would have been surprised I've if you said it was Donnell, Donnell Jones. But yeah. I or even Dave Hollister. I think I have a picture of him because I still took a picture of him on my little cam. You know the camera disposable joints when you have. Oh yeah, yeah. The graduation. That's a weird response. I thought you was going to say something. Oh, hey, what's up, girls? And then, no, and then goes back to the... He did say nothing. But then looked at them he and said nothing. He just was standing there like as if... I was like, maybe he was drunk or something. You know what I'm saying? Like you think maybe like... Maybe he was high. Or something. Who like knows? I was like, what maybe was he was happening? like... But he, he, just, he, he probably said, don't even know or remember. I'm sure he don't remember. He just didn't say nothing. That's weird. Wow. That was this, weird. This was when he was big? Like, you know... Yeah, this was... um. He was uh, only I big at one time. Summer rain. Oh, okay. Oh, he was big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. So, wow. Hmm. Yep. That's interesting. Hey, we old as hell. Nah. We I mean, old. I'm, you was I'm, in college, my G? I know. No, no, she was in high school. That was in high oh, school. Oh, oh, yeah. You high was in high school. school. Right. That, Where yeah. was we at? We was in elementary school when she was in? Wait, how old do you think oh, I am? Hold on, man. We're not, we not going to do this. Hold on, man. Hold on. What? What's wrong with what? what? man? She what got us by a year. year. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> do, 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 do. Sorry, I just no. I don't do, 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 do. do. Right. <laughs> How old do you think I am? It was a joke. I'm no, it was not. It was a joke. It was, it was a joke. It's, this is part of a permanent action. Just, How wow, wow. we get treated? Wow. As such, we are just gonna keep playing this this card. No. Yeah. Okay. Right. <laughs> oh, I got a uh, a viewer submission. They want to know. Hold on, my if bad. If fat means it's greasy. Nah, <laughs> oddly enough, people want to know about us. That ain't odd. I'm a Leo. I get people who want to know about me every day, bro. You so they want to know. <laughs> what, 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 that was a viewer submission. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> Go ahead. We're Sir. good. All right, so they want to know what were our first jobs, like the first jobs we ever had. Okay. All of us. And also, <laughs> well, I'll let you guys say it first, and then I'll uh, give a follow-up question. Am I going first? You can, ladies first. Yeah. My very first job, which I hated, I was a buffet girl at Country Kitchen. It was country kitchen. It's a it's somewhere. a restaurant. It was like a um, it was a restaurant in where I grew up in Kansas, and I had to work. I only could work weekends at that time, because because of you know like laws and stuff. Mm -hmm. You know you can only work weekends. Mm -hmm. So they had you know Friday night and Saturday night of you know buffet, and both nights were buffet. I think Friday night was like maybe the crab leg night. So I had to like cook the crab legs, keep them warm, and run it, run them, run it. Oh, wow. I hated that job. And then on on Saturday night, we had to cut this. It was like a uh, what is it? I guess it's like sirloin or brisket, brisket. Ah. So we cut the brisket for the, them as they came, and then you know put it Serve on their plate, them. you know. Serve but them. it was a buffet. What? First of all, how old were you? Fourteen. Dang. Okay, so I just thought about okay. All right. What about you? I just want to know why this person wants to know this. I told you they want to know about us. Um, that's, a, that's a good... Uh... I think it's weird. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think it's a setup, but I'm going to go ahead and answer the question. All okay. right. Answer the question. Uh, I worked for... Uh, in high school, I had a job. I think like my junior year is a job during the summer. It was a summer job. Okay. I work for the, uh, it's actually a, a pretty decent story. I work for a company called CPC. I can't remember what they did, or, but it was like a, um, they, they did like cleanup stuff, like for like parks, like metal oh. parks and planning and stuff oh, like okay. that. Okay. All right. So 
we were scheduled at different locations and different sites. Yeah, anyway, yeah. our site was Rock Creek Park. Oh. Over by the Woodley Zoo area. So I have to take oh. I had to take the blue to the red, red. Man, that is a wood. different experience. No. Oh, oh, every day during the summer. Wow. And what made it more interesting Okay. It was that it was the year Sandra Levy went missing and it was this whole big thing. Oh. And then they found out that there was a chance that she could be in Rock Creek Park. Yeah. So we would be in the park chilling and we would just like hear like look and we would see random detectives, groups of detectives oh. walking through. Yeah. Walking through wow. the joint. And oh. we would make jokes like, yo, what if we run up on this joint? Like, what do oh, we do? On the buy on the girl. Yeah. Because at the time, we didn't really think she was in there. We just thought, they don't know what this bitch is. Oh, right. They right, just, right. They just come to find out she was in the joint, though. In there. Yeah. Which was crazy. Damn, that is crazy. Yeah, so. That's wild. That was, uh, I was some others. That was like my first time. That was my first experience with weed. Uh, yeah, that was, yeah. Okay. Good, good, good time. Yeah. 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 Right. I didn't smoke it. Just. Experience. I, yeah, I don't do nothing for the first time. Same, same, Vaccines, same iPhones, <laughs> uh, uh, PS5s. I let y'all take the first version. I don't even go. In. I don't even go to movies on opening night. You nigga. come in three Yeah, I'm a, well, I'm gonna get the best version of whatever. So I got you. Are right, you up? Uh, my first job was. Uh, well, I always had like little hustles, but my first like real W two. Mm-hmm. Was Six Flags. Oh, I had that's to go. A cool job. That was the best job I ever. I'm about to say. <laughs> if I could, if I could line up at that age, if I could line Man. up for a job, that would be. The I don't job. even know how I got that job. I don't even know how it happened. Probably your parents. I just know I had to get a little work permit because I was like 14, mm-hmm. 15, something like that. And I went and got that joint, and then I started working at Six Flags off the summer tip. And that joint was the best job that I ever had. Mm. I swear to you. Bro, all I did with my my money is buy shoes, dog. Yeah. Niggas couldn't tell me. I, I was so... And the funny thing is, y'all know, I was, you know, I was I was never... At that age, I had a late growth spurt, so... You was a little bun. Yeah, I was a little bun still. <laughs> no, so, for a while... Yeah, this, I mean, no, it's cool. So, buns. for a while, I could still get shoes because they was under $100. Because I was still wearing seven and a halfs. Nigga, I'm, you had big feet when we was in elementary school. Maybe. <laughs> that was relative to my body, but they Too but sure. they still weren't sure. they still weren't men's <laughs> sizes. That's true. Right. A size seven right. back then probably right. looked like a eleven. Left to on, us. on me. Right. <laughs> right, right. So Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, dog. I never thought about that. Yeah, dog. So I was uh, so I all I did was buy shoes. I was like, what? I don't have to ask my mama for money for sh-. because that's her thing. Yeah. Why am I buying you a hundred dollar pair of shoes and you don't have no job? I don't have a hundred dollar pair of shoes and I work. So I anyway, little duckers. I know I bought shoes, but I don't know what else I did with my little duckers. I was out here in these streets. But anyway, they wanted to know if. We would want our children to have those as first jobs. Oh. Why, why not? Um. (laughs) (laughs) Off rip, yes. Off the rip. I know every single one of my kids would enjoy working there. Or based off the experience that I have. I don't know how it is now. Yeah. It could be a different story now, but based on what I know... Go on up in there. So at the end of this camp that I worked at, <laughs> there was like a uh, sleepaway weekend um, for all of the participants. Oh. And uh, see, here's the thing. The people that we, that our supervisors were just like young adults, like oh, yeah. kids in their 20s, mm-hmm. mid you know, voluntary. Okay. So the, the supervision and the uh, adult presence was very minimal. minimal. As with Six Flags. Right. Um, with that being said, I left out some things of, about, about that, about that, that <laughs> summer. Um, and I left them all on purpose. <laughs> However, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. Okay. No. 
Yeah, no, you my, can't go. Yeah, no, my my job no. sucked too mm. bad to do that. So no, um, I would say no. The only thing I'd be hesitant about is my daughter. That's what I'm. Well, that's all I got, bro. But I still wouldn't be like, nah. I'd be like, go ahead. I'd be like, you can go to Wait the man. job every day, why, but why? you're not going to the little sleepaway event at the end with everybody. Because you get everybody else's phone number. Y'all can play games online. Yeah. Do whatever you gotta do. If you wanna why? go out with one of the little boys, the let me know. I will drive you to the location. What happens at the sleepaway stuff? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I've never been to a sleepaway camp. Look, there was just stuff. No, like I said, I was exposed to a lot of things that I was aware of. I just had always been under adult supervision. Like, there was nothing. There was never an avenue or thought process for me to even pursue. I wasn't even was. prepared, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like. <laughs> Yeah, buddy. So you know, yeah. But much like that. It but was, I, but it was I, after parties, I, I had a, so. it was a joy. It was a fun job, though. God, I enjoyed it. it. The park yeah. used to close. Yeah, I bet. And then it would be open to us. That's probably dope. And probably. it was nothing but space and opportunity. Teenagers. Yeah. And maybe like one or two security adults that, that were what like twenty one, twenty two. Doing it in the park. Doing it after dark. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Rock, Rock Creek Park. Park. Oh, Is maybe. That that I don't know. Maybe. Have you ever seen Adventureland? Yes. With uh, Kristen yes. Stewart? Yes. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, it was better than that. Oh. I saw the movie and was like, oh, I could have done way better. Right, than this. right, right, right. I could have yeah. done way better. Oh, that was the best job yeah, I ever yeah, had. Yeah, In the yeah, realm yeah. of jobs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. working? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, the worst part about that job hey, can we was ask my for first week. What? what I had to maybe my first two weeks. I didn't. I didn't. I was new there, so I didn't know how things went. Oh, and I worked in the food service department, right? Mm -hmm. So I came in, you know, fresh meat. So they like, yeah, they divvying up the jobs. I don't know that I could be like, I don't want to go here, or, you know. Right. So they like, you gonna be outside. So I had to stand outside with the cart. Make sure the ice stayed icy mm -hmm. with the drinks and sell them drinks in the heat. Mm -hmm. So I did that for about two weeks. Once I got my feet wet in that joint, I realized I could move I around a little that. bit, like, finagle a little bit. Oh, man, I was up in the dipping Dots joint that had the <laughs> AC pumping. You hear me? Had my little stash right there. I'm like, yeah, what you need? All right, cool. <laughs> yeah, so you know, little ladies walking by, but it's a hell hey, right. How y'all doing? doing? I'm like, here you go. You know, I got little dip and dip. Over here. Little uh, dot for your dip. You, you know hear me? Shit. <laughs> 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 man, we had a ball over that joint. That's all I'm going to say. Yeah. Well, that, I'm glad for y'all. That's all I'm going to say. I'm glad for y'all. I want to know to this viewer why you want to know that. <laughs> We're going to find out. Find Why out. you want to know? Leave Why you want to know? Uh, you know. I have a question. Uh-oh. Not question. The re a statement. You agree and disagree. The reason men don't get excited about um, lingerie no more, queens, is y'all be wearing it outside with oh. Air Max on. <laughs> is I that get true? It. I, I, uh... Do y'all not get excited about lingerie no more? I mean... That was just a question I had. Is that true? So let me say something. Lingerie does look nice. It yeah. definitely does. I'm not, I don't downplay lingerie. Um, However. The reason, to my knowledge, men don't get excited about lingerie is because as much as you put on, you, is it? you still rather be naked. It's going to come <laughs> off. Just, it's going to come off. <laughs> I mean, like, it looked good, and it, don't get me wrong. I ain't. You know, I'm like, wow. Yeah, the, yeah. I think the thing I appreciate about appreciate about lingerie the most is that to me, you making an effort. The effort. That's oh, what it is yeah. for me. Okay. And I'm like, oh, I agree, hundred oh. percent. Oh, you did that for You're me in the mood like okay. that. Sure, well, let me get myself ready. <laughs> don't mind right. if I do. What I gotta do? <laughs> take a couple of shots. Oh, and, uh, okay, hey, so let me go get some baby oil and rub yeah, it on a pet right. or something. <laughs> I might have to take a shower tonight, girl. Oh, you gonna get yeah. your clean work tonight. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. 
<laughs> nah, I would agree 100%. But, you know? but, 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 yes, I mean, strip clubs, you know, women wearing stuff outside. Right. Yes. It, ha- it happens and, so And much women now. are Instagram. Yeah. And, of course, guys still look at it. But, yes, it is a little bit more accessible. And now it's just like. Yeah, just imagine it's somebody so from the 80s. That's the thing. I don't have to imagine no more. Being so here, like, just coming straight from the 70s and, and, and coming here and like, giving them our Instagram. They'd be like, what? They'd be like, oh, 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 hold on, man. <laughs> it's so I'm funny. Um, my eight-year-old, I had to make a, a stop at um, a Samoa, which is like a bra and panty shop. Um, and we walked in there. And he was like, oh, my God, Mom, what are we doing here? <laughs> I was like, what's wrong? I didn't realize he Girl was of that age right. yet yeah. where it would was get like, What's happening? He was like, Mom, Overload. Mom, my daughter. Mom. Mom, well, I was like, what's wrong? Like, I'm not supposed to be seeing this. That's exactly what he said. He was like, I don't think I'm supposed to be in here. Well, we, well, we. Boots. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Boots. <laughs> Look, when we would go to Target and we were walking through the aisles with my daughter, she'd be like, Daddy, cover your eyes. I'm like, why? She's like, no, this woman, this section is for women only. Yeah. I'm like, oh, okay, sorry. Yeah, my bad. Yo, well, and, she, you know, we'll cover my eyes. Same thing. She's like, you can't walk through there. Oh really? Yeah, oh, really? I was like, "What you mean? Right, we just right. you know, we trying to get to the men's Men section. section. It's this way. Yeah, that's where I was going. She's like, "Yeah, but you gotta go around. You have to go around." Wow. I was like, "Come on here, yeah, right, right. right?" After a while, I was like, "Look." I was like, "Oh, she know, yeah. Oh, right. yeah." This that's, is that's story. funny though, but that is funny. Yeah, he was his. I, he wouldn't take it off either. I was like, "Well, just stand here and don't move next to me." He was like, "This, okay, I'll stand." <laughs> He wasn't ready for all that. <laughs> he was not ready for all that. And he wasn't even going to act like he was. Yeah. He was yeah, like, but... whoa, whoa, whoa. What's happening? <laughs> Let me know when it's safe. <laughs> Boops. <laughs> yeah, yeah but uh, to all y'all ladies watching, don't stop wearing lingerie. Yeah, definitely. Don't stop. Jazz it up. No. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. Maybe even get the lingerie that makes everything accessible quicker, though. <laughs> <laughs> because that will probably be. Because yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah, everybody got time to be fiddling with doing yeah, no. Well, the other away. side of that is, you know, our grandmothers wore like a good moo moo. Mm. You know what I'm saying? They that, just had You know what? That was their lingerie. Yeah. Their house coat. The, uh, whatever. They pick you up from the bus what? stop. Where and they had Go at to least the twelve kids store. each. I need un- I, you know what I, I'm gonna keep it real. Easy I like right unintentional lingerie. I like shit that you, you know, you don't. Oh, oh, I was just coming to the door to open the door because you was there. I didn't want to, but I was in the shower, and I just threw on. You know, Do I like song. yeah, like I like stuff like even that. even though it is intentional. Maybe, but but it may not be. It may not be. Maybe, but you but know. it is. But you understand <laughs> what I'm saying, though. You know, like I understand what you're saying. You want to be in the illusion. I kind of just, you know, want to be at the dinner table one day and if walk it, downstairs. You wanted to be a more of walk a spontaneous downstairs, thing. butt naked, and and notice that there's a dish in the sink, and decide to bend over to put it in the sink and walk back upstairs and look at me like this. I agree. <laughs> That's what I want. I just made that scenario up in my brain. That's it. Hey, I'm look. like. I'm, I would, that would be the quickest dinner <laughs> I've ever eaten. It reminds me of this dude I used to work with. This girl was getting married, right? And so she was like, you know, talking to him because he'd been married for years. Right. And she was like, you know what? Give me some advice. You know what I'm saying? You know, for, mm-hmm. you know, for my husband mm-hmm. or whatever. He was like, oh, I got you easy. She was like, random Tuesday. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, he coming home. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know, y'all got the house to yourself. He was, he was like, just meet him at the door. As soon as he opened the door, all he need to see is you bent over. Just Ooh. right for two. He said, oh! <laughs> he, said, he, said, he said, and look, I was sitting there like this. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> he ain't lying. 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 That's what that reminds me of. I don't of, think bro. no guy watching or listening to this is going to deny nope. that at all. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Put us in the mix. Put us in the in the spontaneous illusion. Yeah, do That's that. all you got to do. Yeah. I agree. Keep them on their toes. Yeah. Keep them on their toes. Keep them on toes. On that note, stay on y'all toes. Hey, yeah. man. Hey. Hey. Oh, ten toes down. You feel me? Hey. What your girl say? Uh, My girl. What'd she say? 
Get up on the get up on the tiptoes and what she say? Who? Oh, you talking about sit on Haddish? it? No, I'm talking about what the big old freak. Oh, Lizzo. Right. Oh, you talking about if anybody ride to the tip tip trolling and rode to the tip like, like me? Whatever she said, I said. Like, oh, oh, what's that? oh, oh, like, oh, <laughs> oh, yeah, you take it back with that <laughs> one. <laughs> when they do that, <laughs> <laughs> when they do that, <laughs> 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 